Hey East Tennessee Vapors, it's EJ Duggan back with you at the Ball Guys Vape Arcade and today we're going to do something just a little bit different. This is going to be called a quick hit. Quick hits will be short shows where I can talk to you about one thing in particular and not have to roll it into several different things for a full size show. What I really want to talk to you about today is this new flavor out of Boardwalk Vapes called Captain Krusty. Um, you guys have heard me talk about Boardwalk before. I love their flavors. Uh, Mugshot is absolutely one of my all time favorite flavors. So I got word that Captain Krusty was down at Cloud9 in Sevierville. And when I heard that, I rushed over, had to try it, and I picked up a bottle of Captain Krusty. Now, um, first thing you'll notice is there, it's at three milligrams. Boardwalk, hats off to you. I really appreciate being able to get these flavors now in three. I prefer it to six, so that's really exciting for me. So guys, without any ado, let's get to Captain Krusty. I love, I love, love, love this flavor. And I have to tell you, as much as I love Mugshot and I am crazy about that caramel apple, Captain Krusty is easily, easily my new favorite flavor from Boardwalk. And uh, let's, let's talk about the flavor profile. Um, it's described as a, uh, I think, oatmeal with honey. Now, I'm going to reverse that for me because I'm definitely getting honey with oatmeal. As I started vaping on this when I first tried it, I got a lot of oatmeal and honey, and I, I think maybe as my um, my taste buds have adjusted to it, that honey is continuously staying in there. Sometimes on a vape, um, you'll you'll get used to it as you continue to vape on it uh, at a, a long period of time, and those flavors will, will decrease just a bit. You always get the most flavor on your initial hit, and then it decreases a bit. With Captain Krusty, I get this continuous, gorgeous, delicious honey, and I, I cannot tell you how good that honey is. Um, to give you an example, there are two things that you need to know about Cloud9 and Sevierville. The first one is, is that I don't make a lot of guarantees. I'm, I'm not going to make guarantees, usually in general on this show, it's all about opinions, what I think about this, what I think about that, but I will guarantee you one thing. If you go to Cloud9 and Sevierville, you will be walking on absolutely the cleanest, nicest floors you have ever seen in a vape shop. Jeff takes these floors very seriously, so that I guarantee you. But actually, the second thing you need to know about Cloud9 is that Jeff is a very smart guy. Why do I say that? As I was there, I was hanging out for a couple hours. I don't have anything better to do on a Friday. Um, I was hanging out for a couple hours at Cloud9, and Jeff was very smart. He had Captain Krusty loaded up. Um, and he was uh, greeting people as I come in. Hey guys, welcome to Cloud9, come on in. You know what, just got this in today, give it a shot, so tell me what you think. And one by one, as I was there for a couple hours, cha-ching, 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 people were picking up Captain Krusty, it was flying off the shelves. So don't take my word for it, um, people are really digging Captain Krusty and I, I really don't blame them. Guys, that's a quick hit, I would tell you to check out Captain Krusty. Um, I had to do it. This show is born out of necessity because this bottle has been just going down. This is just uh, less than two days later and there's nearly nothing left, but I really had to talk about it with you guys. I love this stuff. That's a quick hit on Captain Krusty from Boardwalk. Huge fan. If you want to check it out, go down to Cloud9. Um, I'm hoping Jeff is going to reorder some soon. I got to get some more. We'll see you next time.